Okay, let's say you want to, um, you have a flash banner and you want to add a hyperlink, a uh, link to a website or something like that. Okay, I've got an empty flash banner here that I'm working on. I've got a uh, background layer and um, I have no animations on it, but I'm just going to show you how to do, like if you wanted to add a hyperlink. So what you would do is, um, it could be a picture or it could be text. So it could be, uh, let's say like a piece of text. I'm going to put it on this new layer here. I'll make a new layer for it. And, um, you know, go to my site. Right? And I'll just do that. And properties here. It's dynamic text. I want to make this static text. Okay, I'm going to make sure that's static text. I'll change the uh, color of it. Uh, let's see here. Let's change the color. Okay, so there's my um, text. And I'm also going to take this text. I'll grab my selection tool here. And I'm going to convert it to a movie clip. I'm going to prefer to do that. So uh, modify, convert to symbol, movie clip. All right. So now I've got this, this movie clip that... Um, that I want to make um, a link essentially. I'm going to go to the property window one more time, open up a property window, give it a name. I'll just call it link. Okay, so now if I was to select it once there, highlight it basically, property window, its name is link. Okay, all right, so time to write the actions. Now, this is, I'm going to show you Action Script 2.0. If you go to File, Publish Settings, Flash, I'm using Action Script 2.0 here. See that? 2.0. So um, open up your Actions window, which you can get to by Window uh, Actions, or just hit F9. And I'm going to put these actions on a separate frame. So uh, I mean a separate layer. So I'll make a new layer, call it Actions, right? And I'll say link dot on press equals a function open and close parentheses oops sorry about that open and close parentheses um, then open a curly brace and then closed curly brace okay um, let me see if this is that's probably I did that off screen so um, sorry about that let me put that back on screen here for you. All right, there it is. So link, which is the name of my movie clip, dot on press with a capital P equals function. Um, open, open curly brace, close curly brace. And I'll just say on this next, in between the two curly braces, get URL in all caps. Then it tells me exactly when I open up the next um, parentheses, it tells me what it needs. It wants the URL wants the window and wants the method okay URL window method okay so what I'm gonna do is URL first okay so in quotation marks I'll type HTTP colon forward slash forward slash yahoo.com for instance let's say and then I'm gonna put a comma and for the window I'll say uh, underscore blank to open up in a new window, right? And then I don't. I'm not even going to put the method. The method means uh, get or post or something like that. I'm not going to put that. I'll just close the parentheses, put a semicolon, okay? And then, and then see if it works, right? So if I hit, um, so there it is. Hit Control Enter to paste your movie. If I roll over it, I should see it turn into a link, which it does. Turns into a button. And if I click it right we'll see what happens oh there it goes it's opening up a web browser and it's trying to go to yahoo.com it's opened up a new link and uh, I don't have an active internet connection right now so it didn't work but um, but it tried so that's all that matters so it works all right and that's it so I just use the uh, get URL um, uh, function to open up a uh, web page in a blank window. 
which is in a new window. And so you could use that on your site. The key here is the name link here is the name of my movie clip that I'm uh, targeting here. So link, this is link movie clip. Let's say you want it to be a piece of art. Well, if you want it to be a piece of art, that's easy too. Let's say you have like a, I don't know, you know, a circle, same principle. You just make your circle, right? Double click on it, a piece of art, any piece of art, right? And then uh, modify, convert to symbol, turn it into a movie clip. Now it's a movie clip. Give it a name. Link to, hit enter to make sure it takes, right? And then that's fine. So now also the other thing is I like to put my act, my um, action script not on the movie clip. I like to put it on the, the keyframe. So I select my keyframe first where I have my actions. If you, if you So you don't get confused on this. You see if you have if you've selected the keyframe, the actions window will say actions frame. If by accident you've selected the movie clip, it says actions movie clip. For me, I find it much easier to put all my action script on the keyframe. So I select the keyframe, then I open up the window, then I put in my code. I'm just going to copy, control C, paste, and I could call this link to dot on press. Go to http dot com dance courses dance courses dot com and I'm ready to go and now I'm all set for link 2 just to make sure do I have that named link 2 yes I do that's it